Vengeance of Hope. I'll have to go with the painful way. That was for last time. the bond between us. This ought to be interesting. Hey, on no occasion whatsoever, cheers to you again, Lord Dionysus, mate. This place is so much less dreary under your influence. This is the greatest, Zag, this feast I'm headed to. I was getting a little concerned I wasn't gonna have quite enough to go around for everyone. Well, you just saved my evening, man. Too bad you couldn't be there, yeah? <laughs> I've got a feeling this time, man, like things are really going to take a turn for you, and I mean for the better, almost certainly, I think. <laughs> Let's liven things up. grows stronger. Aphrodite, surely you have all the offerings you can stand, but I would ask that you accept one more. Oh, dearest, but it stirs my heart to know you care so deeply for a wonderful relationship. To celebrate it with such princely gifts. What is going on down there, dearest? I thought for certain you would make it out, but it seems that nasty place has kept you grounded, hasn't it? But don't despair, and you take heart, won't you? Chaos, forebear of the gods, it is an honor to have met you. Please accept this gift. So the mortals or immortals think of making offerings to me. As I do not expect such token gestures, I am very much amused, and I... The charms of goddess Aphrodite are upon you unmistakably. Although I shall be curious to see if her command over one's sense of love shall have any effect beneath the earth. Hmm, let's 
see what else. of incurring your wrath, Lady Artemis. I hope you will accept this from me and see that my gratitude for all you have done for me is genuine. What do you know? Another gift of nectar. That's quite thoughtful of you, Zagreus. Normally don't care much for the stuff, but every now and then, I mean, why not? You must have a friend or two, don't you? It's hard being alone all of the time. At least I have Callisto and the other nymphs and... I have you. A distant friend is still a friend, isn't that right? Let's hunt some dead. Oh no. I'll give these wretches not a minute more. Come on then.
favorite. How about some other boons instead? It's not that I'm upset or anything here, Zag. You know I'm not. But truthfully, I am a bit annoyed. A little bit. And so I got to send them. I don't like this. any longer here. have been of such help, good Lady Demeter. I'm honored, and this is the least I can do in exchange. I was quite certain that the youth today was lacking any sort of tactfulness, young Zagreus. For once, I'm thankful to be proven wrong. I have a brother, Helios the Sun, a nonsense talker with a flaming chariot. Why, he once told me that my Kore that she went into that underworld of yours. Preposterous. The clouds now blot him out entirely. Hello, Fury sisters. Finally. You ready, Megara? To Siphony? Let's go.
Yeah. Majesty, this will be perfect for my latest recipes. You know, of all the souls I've ever met, I feel like you put this stuff to the best possible use. You look like you haven't eaten since you were here last. Sure, here. Smooth Cheers. Sailing.
heads you'd like chopped off? No? I need. There, that's it. Interloper! Witness. I'll take it. For you, swift and sure-footed messenger of the gods, you make what you do look easy, but I know you're going out of your way. My rule is not to let things get too personal as far as work-related matters are concerned, cuz, but your family, and, well, you're a right decent chap, I think, offering up a bit of nectar to me in the middle of all this. Message from Olympus for you, boss. It says, it sure is nice up here upon this mountain, not having to escape the underworld. Come join us soon, won't you? Let's go, let's go. You ever make it out of here, short one? I wonder sometimes what it must be like, the outside. You've never been outside? Oh right, the labyrinth thing. You lived in a horrible maze all your life. I haven't seen much of the surface, but it's beautiful. Cold. When I'm there though, I feel out of place. Out of place? I understand, I think. I don't see why you'd want to go somewhere like that. You can't live up to the stories. Why ruin it? Speaking of which...
Theseus, I said hi. Hi, Aphrodite. Olympus, I accept this message. I know you serve the realm. I just wanted to say I look forward to continuing to work with you in a somewhat more official capacity. I'll still be breaking out of here like always, but, well, you've probably heard. Appreciate your support. Enjoy it, Charon, mate. Don't go thinking I'm just being kind to get you to lower your prices for me. That would be unconscionable. you against me, Asterius. I can see it in his mismatched eyes. I cannot shake the terrible vision that someday or night it shall be me standing alone here whilst you, whilst you take sides against me with that fiend. Asterius, about that, please consider it a standing offer if you like. I'd rather have you as a friend than as a foe. Not sure that I can say the same for Theseus, of course. You 
poisonous worm. I knew you had a more sinister trick at play, because your fighting style certainly is of no concern just on its own. Are there truly no depths to which you would not stoop? It is my privilege to have met you and have learned your death-inflicting way. I do appreciate this gift to me, although you really shouldn't have. The suffering which you inflict is ample compensation in itself. Far 
are my closest kin in all the underworld. I see you there, I think. What sort of violence shall we sow together this time, you and I? on the hunt has not developed social graces suitable enough to come to you herself. Social graces, she says, going about like that. I'm sure you know that I can find you when it's necessary, Zagreus. Though how to get away from Aphrodite, I have no idea. comes to you by riverboat this time, young Sagris. At least that Charon is amenable to our attempts to contact you. Associate there with the boats. Source of the recently departed gotta make it over to the underworld somehow. Part of my job. I bring them in, he takes them down. already. Shiny. Oh, what is this stuff? Should I go fight some satyrs to get out of here? Sack coming right up. Maybe this way.
enough of this place. You hungry, Cerberus? I bet you are. Should come in useful. Just playing. Cerberus moves for no one, but for Satus Axe, he can make an exception. I owe you one, boy. Nice night, no? Last, but you're persistent even now. Though let us see how strong you are as well. for me. Done with time to spare. Imagine, if you will, the underworld prince soon meets one of his typical ignoble deaths. Oh, 
Uh, well, that was pretty good, all in all. I'm up, I'm up. Congratulations, boy. Here's what I caught lately. Pleasure doing business. I'll take it. That's too good a deal to pass up. You always offer means to quench my thirst, my friend. A wonder that I have such feelings even now. Now that you've started singing once again, I figured it was thirst-inducing work. Your music stirs so many souls around here, mate. <laughs> well, this is like a dream come true. I mean, how come you're always being so darn nice to me? But anyway, um, thanks. Sure thing, Hypnos. Knock yourself out. Lad, all this generosity, I don't want you to get the wrong idea. I'm alone, yes, but my heart belongs to another. Ever since I was alive, I hope you understand. I somehow knew that was the case, Achilles. I wanted you to have this anyway. Just don't drown your sorrows, as they seem to make you stronger. Thank you, then. And do not worry about me. I'm long since past my sorrow, and the rage I felt when first my heart was broken. Now it's but another scar. They say it's our scars that give us character. Um, Meg? <laughs> Meg. Oh, I was not expecting company. Were you just casually snooping, or is there something I can help you with? I was just leaving Zagreus. Happened to be in the area, no thanks to you, and thought I'd go retrieve the last of my possessions. I have to say, you really let this place go to hell. She left. Great. Wonderful. I guess we'll just go back to killing each other repeatedly then. father. on about her missing girl, Zagreus. But I want you to understand something, all right? She's gone. We all have grieved. Perhaps Demeter shall finally accept what has occurred, and we can move forward, having grown stronger as a family.
protecting these. Lady Artemis, your mighty blessings have helped me through so many trials now, and I always welcome your level-headed presence here. Look, I like being worshipped just as much as anybody, Zagreus, though bear in mind that you can always leave the worship of me to the forest nymphs, all right? So, I have heard that Achilles himself taught you how to fight. No wonder you can hold your own down there. That is amazing. Do you be sure to honor him from time to time, got it? The dead had better hide. You and me, Sneak. Uncle Poseidon, I have a special catch for you, although it pales next to your sheer awesomeness. How would you look at that? Is that an offering to your most favorite uncle, me? You know what, nephew? I've decided I shall take it. Thanks! <laughs> nephew, why, the seas up here. They're just about as widely feared as your vast underworld down there. The water can be deadlier than bronze. Might of the sea. of the underworld, this is your chance. Oh, this is trouble.
useless. Peace and quiet. What do we have? Olympians never consorted with Cathonic gods such as yourself, but it sounds like Hermes is a close colleague of yours. You wouldn't happen to know why he's helping me, would you? Uh, I'm sorry, mate. I meant you no offense. Thank you, mate. Ladies. Murder. 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 Oh, curse of chaos. set. Yeah, what do you want? Oh, sure don't see a lot of other... 
I've never met another nymph, now that you mention it. Heard of a few. The goddess Artemis sounds like she spends more time with nymphs than the other Olympians. That's what I heard. Though it's not like we all hang out. I mean, you've got the Dryads and the Naiads and the Nereids and the Oceanids. Pretty much every type of terrain up top, there's a kind of nymph who loves it. Maybe we need a name for Underworld. Huh? I knew it. Hmm, really hit the spot. Okay, bye. of death, you're here. There's more at stake for you in this than just my plight. You care so much about this family. That care and your determination spurs me on. I'm ever grateful. Perhaps there really is no time quite like the present when it comes to showing thanks to one another, my dear cousin. You've opened my eyes to the possibility, though I remain steadfast in my resolve to fight for you. Whatever difficulties you've encountered, dear cousin, again and again you have never yielded. I must admit, your strength of will is quite inspiring, for even I have doubts from time to time. It's all the clearer to me why the goddess Nyx spoke so highly of you. I'd like to see more options.
worth it. This time, absolute cream of the crop right here. You're gonna go real far. Moving right along. to see you once again. Gemstones. The Vanquishers keep. The Bloodless failed to stop them once again. Caught. Closer. Check. Champions of Elysium, I've returned.
that big soul catcher again. Say we deal some death together, Zagreus. I'll handle this. Cut it under control, thanks. Not yet.
Olympus, I accept this message. No royalty, most certainly not any I would recognize. He's but a nameless, long-forgotten minor god, born of the depths and bound to stay in them. I too once was berated by such words, King. We faced this enemy how many times? At my estimation, he's fought bravely here. Bravely? Hiding behind those pillars is what you call bravely, Asterius? We shall have to discuss this strange lapse of judgment after we achieve our victory.
take the service exit, thanks. Don't tend to the CETA problem for a change. Beats dying. Why not? So close. Look in the bag. in here. for me. Your wisdom guide me.
keep searching. Kind of nice out here. I see it's time again that we begin our bloody business here. Subjects to stay out of this. 
is getting rather good at this, but let us say he perished anyhow. Huh? 